Look at the following diagram carefully and answer all the questions. So in the diagram, um, angle I is parallel, parallel to the lines A and G H. So this is the diagram. And we told us that A is equal to 70. And the angle DCH is equal to X. And CDE equals Y. And Bay AC equals Z. And AC bisects DCH and by six men's cut in half. So the questions are A. Find two corresponding angles equal to A. Find two alternating angles equal to A. And find the values of X, Y, and Z. So first let's do A. So find two corresponding angles equal to a so corresponding angles is um, when two lines when two lines cross by another line which is called the transversal the angles is matching corners are called um, corresponding angles so a so the two corresponding angles equal to a is this angle so it's a i d so this one is the same angle as a so this is also 70 degrees and the other one is this one h c i so this is 70 this is also 70 so the two angles are um, A, so answer, it's A, I, um, D, and so this is 70, so this is also 70, so it's A, I, D, and H, C, I. So number, letter B, find two alternating angles equal to a. Now, alternate angles are the set of non-adjacent angles on either side of the transversal. So, it's A, A, I, D, so this angle, and also B, I, C. So, these two angles are alternating. So, And these are these angles are equal to A. So this angle and then this angle. So it's A I D this angle and also B I C. These are 70 degrees. So find the values of X, Y, and C. So this is the x. So they told us that a. Uh, so these are x is the same as a. This is also seventy degrees. So x is equal to a, the same as a, and a is equal to seventy. So that means that x is equal to seventy also. So find the value of y. So y is this angle, so this is y. So this whole thing is 180, and if a is equal to 70, so it's equal to 180 minus um, 70, or this is equal to 110 degrees. So this is y is equal to 100. 10 because um, the whole thing is 180 and a is equal to 70 that means that this side is equal to 110 so find z so z is this angle 
so they told us that um this one a to c um bisects d c h d c h in half so cuts in half that means that this one is half so that means that this one this angle is 35 and this angle is 35 so that means that this is also 35 z is equal also to 35 or we do it this way so it's so z is equal to so let's take this um angle this part so if we take this angle and this part this part is 35 since this whole thing is 70 so that means that this is all this is 35 and this is 110 so this is 110 and this is 35 and this is um, Z so that means that the whole thing is 180 so this is equal to so this one 110 plus this angle plus Z is equal to 180 so this is equal to um, 145 plus Z is equal to 180 or we subtract 145 put it on this side so z is equal to 180 minus 145 it's equal to 35 degrees or you can just look at this way since this one bisects in half so that means that this is 35 this is 35 so and this is 110 so that means that this is also 35 so these are the answers so x is equal to 70 and y so y is equal to 110 degrees and z is equal to 35 degrees.